Hey guys, this is Paige from Bebom.com and hi, I'm here in San Francisco for the Galaxy Unpacked 2020 and Samsung has announced the S20 series, the S20, the S20 Plus and the S20 Ultra. Now the S20 Ultra is the beastly among the three, so I'm going to focus on that. Yeah, I went hands on with the Galaxy S20 Ultra, so let's check it out. So this is the new Galaxy S20 Ultra and this is the flagship that's going to get all the limelight because it's simple. The S20 Ultra is the most powerful Samsung flagship ever. This phone is a specs monster. Now starting off with the design front, the Galaxy S20 Ultra like the S20 and the S20 Plus has the glass bag with the new rectangular camera module like a bump and this camera module features some insane specs. Anyway, on the front you get this massive display which like the Note 10 last year has a center punch hole. This is a 6.9 inch dynamic AMOLED display. Yeah, it's massive. And this is a 120Hz 20-9 panel, which in typical Samsung fashion looks stunning. It looks beautiful and yeah, it should be smooth at 120Hz. Anyway, the design and display is nice, but the truly groundbreaking thing about the S20 Ultra are its cameras. Let's check out the specs. A 108 megapixel primary sensor, a 12 megapixel ultra wide angle sensor, a 48 megapixel telephoto slash periscope lens and a 3D time of flight sensor. Now Samsung has done away with the dual aperture main camera but this is a power packed camera setup. Now you can take usual shots from the S20 Ultra but the most outrageous thing about it is the 100x zoom. Yeah, As you can see mentioned on the back there's 100x zoom support aka space zoom. The periscope zoom lens offers 10x optical hybrid zoom which is multiplied 10 times to get 100x zoom. Now I haven't tried zooming into space yet but in my brief time with the phone, you can see the transition from 100x to 0.5x, which is ultra wide angle, is insanely cool. Yeah, I love doing this. I only got to play with the phone for a few minutes and it wasn't at an ideal place for 100x zoom shots, but yeah, I can't wait to try it out. Well, that's not all though. Another big change is the Galaxy S20 Ultra is also capable of recording 8K 30fps footage. I'm not sure if it will be useful right now, but it does sound exciting. I mean, Samsung's whole event was shot from the S20 Ultra, so it'll be interesting to see how the S20 fares against the iPhones on the video front. Yeah, it's going to be exciting. On the front, you get a 40 megapixel selfie camera on the S20 Ultra, which outputs 10 megapixel photos by pixel binning. So expect some great selfies from the phone. So the cameras seem really exciting and I haven't talked about a lot of features yet. Anyway, let's get on to the specs, which is just as crazy. So the Galaxy S20 Ultra packs in the Snapdragon 865 5G chipset or the Exynos 990 chipset, which is what we'll probably get in India. And coupled with that is, wait for it, up to 16 gigs of RAM. Yeah, this is the first phone to have that kind of massive RAM. But that's not everything that's massive. There's also the massive, massive battery in tow. We are talking about a 5000 mAh battery with the 45 watt super fast charger in the box. Yeah, the S20 Ultra is like every tech geek's dream come true. Well, from the looks of it, the S20 Ultra has to be one of the most exciting Samsung flagships I have come across. I mean, it packs in the best specs on an Android smartphone. The space zoom feature looks crazy. The video capabilities look impressive and well, it's all packaged in this beautiful design. Well, I can't wait to truly test out the Galaxy S20 Ultra and you guys can expect a lot of videos from us when it lands in India, so stay tuned. That was my quick hands-on video with the Galaxy S20 Ultra. So what do you think about it? Let us know in the comment section below. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and make sure to share it with your friends. Lastly, subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos. Well, that's me signing off. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.